A day in the life of a philosopher, exploring thought and reflection. The life of a philosopher is often shrouded in mystery, characterized by deep contemplation, intellectual pursuits, and a quest for understanding the fundamental questions of existence. In this 3,000-word exploration, we embark on a journey to uncover the daily routines, habits, and experiences that shape the life of a philosopher. Through a detailed account of a hypothetical day in the life of a philosopher, we will delve into the world of thought, reflection, and the pursuit of wisdom. Chapter 1. The Morning Contemplation For a philosopher, the day begins with the rising sun, a symbol of enlightenment and the awakening of the mind. It is in the early hours that many philosophers find solace and clarity, making the morning an essential part of their daily routine. Our philosopher, let's call him Professor John, starts his day by meditating. Sitting in a quiet room, he focuses his thoughts, clearing his mind of distractions. This practice of mindfulness allows him to begin the day with a sense of tranquility and heightened awareness, essential for his work. After meditation, Professor John reads a philosophical text or essay. Today, he chooses to explore the writings of Immanuel Kant. Engaging with the thoughts of great philosophers is a cornerstone of a philosopher's daily life, as it provides intellectual nourishment and inspiration. Chapter 2, The Pursuit of Knowledge Once his morning contemplation is complete, Professor John turns his attention to the pursuit of knowledge. He begins by reviewing his ongoing research projects. Today, he is working on a paper about ethics and moral responsibility, a topic that has occupied his thoughts for months. He dives into his research, consulting a vast array of books, articles, and scholarly papers. The pursuit of knowledge is a never-ending journey for a philosopher, and Professor John's dedication to his craft is evident in the hours he spends delving into the complexities of his chosen subject. In the midst of his research, Professor John takes breaks to jot down his thoughts and insights. Philosophers often keep notebooks or journals to record their musings, creating a reservoir of ideas that may someday become the foundation of a groundbreaking theory or philosophy. Chapter 3, The Socratic Dialogue One of the distinctive features of a philosopher's day is the opportunity for dialogue and discourse. Philosophy thrives on discussion and the exchange of ideas, and Professor John often engages in Socratic dialogues with colleagues and students. Today, he arranges a meeting with a fellow philosopher, Dr. Sarah, to discuss their respective research projects. Over a cup of tea, they engage in a lively debate about the nature of free will and determinism. These dialogues serve not only to refine their ideas but also to challenge and expand their perspectives. In the afternoon, Professor John heads to his university to teach a philosophy seminar. Sharing knowledge with the next generation of thinkers is a rewarding aspect of a philosopher's life. Today's class focuses on the philosophy of ethics, where students grapple with moral dilemmas and engage in thoughtful discussions about ethical theories. Chapter 4, The Creative Pause in the late afternoon, Professor John takes a break from the rigors of academic work to engage in a creative pursuit. Many philosophers find solace in artistic endeavors, such as writing poetry, composing music, or creating visual art. These creative outlets offer a different mode of expression and often lead to fresh insights. Today, Professor John spends his creative pause working on a philosophical essay that explores the concept of beauty in art. He believes that creativity can be a powerful tool for philosophical exploration, allowing him to transcend the boundaries of language and rational thought. Chapter 5, The Evening Reflection As the day draws to a close, Professor John returns to his contemplative practices. The evening is a time for reflection, a period of deep thought about the day's intellectual pursuits and personal experiences. He takes a solitary walk, allowing his mind to wander freely. This reflective time is essential for a philosopher, as it offers an opportunity to synthesize ideas, identify connections, and gain new insights into the questions that have preoccupied him throughout the day. Chapter 6, The Philosophical Dinner In the evening, Professor John often hosts a philosophical dinner with friends, colleagues, and students. 
These gatherings provide a relaxed yet intellectually stimulating environment for discussing a wide range of topics, from ethics and metaphysics to current events and societal issues. Over a hearty meal and good wine, the group engages in spirited conversations, challenging each other's beliefs and offering diverse perspectives. The philosophical dinner serves as a reminder that philosophy is not confined to the ivory tower but is a living, breathing discourse that has a profound impact on our understanding of the world. A day in the life of a philosopher is marked by a relentless pursuit of wisdom, a commitment to contemplation, and a dedication to the exploration of life's most profound questions. While the daily routines and activities may vary, the underlying thread that binds philosophers together is their unquenchable thirst for knowledge and their unwavering commitment to the pursuit of truth. In our exploration of Professor John's day, we have glimpsed into the world of thought and reflection that defines the life of a philosopher. It is a life marked by intellectual rigor, philosophical dialogue, and a deep appreciation for the beauty of ideas. Philosophers, like Professor John, continue to shape our understanding of the human experience, challenging us to question, explore, and expand the boundaries of our knowledge and wisdom.